Hey guys, so I'm most likely not actually going to be jumping into the game right now. Um, just because this little update here to Forza Horizon 3 doesn't really have uh, that much information and it will not take this video very long, I'm most likely going to be either 5 minutes or less, so this is going to be probably one of my shortest videos. I'm, I'm trying to actually start making the really short videos. Seems like those are the ones people enjoy more. I know it is going to sync my data from the TV here, so it might take a while. Um, but yeah, so I do have some interesting info for you guys. It has been released that Forza Horizon 3 in the January DLC car pack will be getting the BMW i8, which has been a very suge uh, suggested car for a very long time. Um, it's not really as... Honestly, they've kind of grown really common, so I've kind of lost interest in them. Uh, I mean, they are an all-electric car, so they don't really make any sounds either. I mean, they're not an all-electric car, but they, do, they don't really make that much sound. Just like Teslas, they're kind of quiet. I mean, you can hear this little electric or something like that, but that's about it. Um, so I don't really know what's going to happen with the BMW i8. It's going to be kind of like the Tesla or whatever in this game, where it's just a car people like and want it in the game. Um, besides that, it is going to be coming in a DLC car pack. Therefore, it's not just going to be all by itself. Uh, there will obviously be more cars with it, which, of course, usually there's at least two or three cars that everybody likes in the packs, such as last time there was the Morgan 3-wheeler, the AMG GTR, and uh, the F-Pace, which I know the F-Pace isn't actually that great, uh, but it was kind of one of those hypish cars because we need more Jaguar in the game. Um, so my thought and kind of everyone else's thought was they did say they're going to release Zenvo because Zenvo is actually in their, um, their agreements in the uh, end credits. So, Zenvo could possibly be one of the cars coming with it, and also, the other car coming with the i8 could possibly finally be the Bugatti Curon, or Chiron, or Curon, or whatever the heck you want to call it. I've heard so many people's different ways of saying it. I, I really like calling it the Chiron, or the Chiron. I know it's more like Curon or something, but it doesn't matter. Everyone has their own way of saying it. There's It doesn't matter. Um... So those could be the possible two other cars that come with the BMW i8. Also, they're probably going to add those really crappy filler cars that nobody really likes. So they'll probably add some kind of classic Holdens or some type of car that has been in some old games that they want to bring back to this game. Of course, they have been re-adding the not-street-legal cars back into this game. So I, I know most not-street-legal cars are kind of impressive, so I just add another one to the DLC pack. Uh, but who knows? I, I don't honestly have no clue. Uh, I do wish they'd bring Sobs back, especially a Sob nut like me would love them to, to be back in the game. I know there's lots of problems going on with Sob right now, uh, with their name and their badge being having to be changed and everything like that, which is really stupid. Um, but at least the Sob 95 will carry on its legacy in uh, their new company. Now, besides maybe adding the new future Sob. I mean, they could add some 2017 models of such things. They could possibly add the 2018 Supra, which would be awesome. I'd love to see the brand new Supra in there. I know it's not technically actually called the Supra, but, I mean, it is actually the Supra. So, you know. Um, but besides that, I could really... I would really like to see them possibly add uh, maybe the new Special McLaren that came out uh, as a side model. I think it was for the 675 that came out. Uh, it's a little bit more of a sporty and spiffy version. Uh, but, of course, that, again, would take away from the uh, crappy filler cars. Uh, but otherwise, I don't know what they would really add for filler cars. I mean, coming from the past, they could maybe add some more of the Salines, which would be awesome, because they've... Like, it seems like every Forza game, it's either, okay, we're going to add a bunch of Salines, or we're only going to add one or two, which is kind of stupid, because everyone loves Salines. They're awesome. Their value stays good for years. Um... I honestly don't think we're even going to get in the game by the end of this video. <laughs> uh, it's kind of just rolling in the background as a filler. Um, yeah, besides that, I don't know. I mean, what do you guys think else could be in this pack? I mean, obviously we are for sure getting the BMW i and the Zenvo and the Chiron Chiron, whatever. You guys can name it what you want. Uh, those two are also like a 50-50 chance car, probably. I don't know. Uh, but of course the BMW i is for sure. So, what do you guys think are going to be the other... I, I don't know how many cars really come in these packs. I don't know if they're all the same number. I think it's around seven each. Uh, so, yeah, who knows? What do you guys think the other five... Five, six, seven, no, maybe four. Four or five extra filler cars are going to be? Uh, well, technically it's six because we don't actually know what the other two 
uh, big top cars they're going to be. Uh, so what do you guys think they're going to be? You guys can go ahead and comment in the description below, or the comments below. I take the description, you take the comments. That how, that's how it works. Uh, but yeah, so what do you guys think it's going to be? Leave the comments in the comments below, of course. And of course, my Instagrams are always in the description below if you guys are interested. And as always, please do leave a like and consider subscribing for more Forza Horizon 3, Ark Survival, and a bunch of other random things. You guys can go ahead and look at my other videos for all the other million things. But anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the video.